In our last video, we created our network location lab and set up the infrastructure to conduct our business using Netgear's Insight. But now, we need to create a wireless guest network in our network location. A prerequisite is that the uplink port at the firewall must be a trunk port, or it must have matching VLAN configuration to that with which we will configure our switch A. To create a guest wireless network, we need an additional VLAN to support the guest traffic and an additional wireless network for access. To create the guest VLAN, select Switch A and then tap on VLANs in use. Click on the plus icon on the top right to create a new VLAN and select Custom Setup. We are going to name our new VLAN Guest and we are going to set up the VLAN ID to 8. Next, tap on Port Members and select Port 1 for the uplink to our firewall and Port 2 where our access point is connected. Then, click on Trunk Port to tag the VLANs on them and tap Save. There, VLAN 8 is up and running on Switch A. Tap on the back icon on the top left until you are back on the Devices page. Now, to create the Wireless Guest Networks SSID, select APA and tap on Wi-Fi Networks and then on Add New Wi-Fi SSID. We are going to name the SSID Inside Guest A. And set a password. Then scroll down and enable Client Isolation. Tap on VLAN and scroll Guest to the center. And tap on Done. Tap on Save and then on OK. There's our Guest SSID on the list now. Tap on the back icon on the top left to get back to the Devices page. With this configuration, when a guest user connects to the guest test A SSID, all of their traffic will be tagged to VLAN A, our guest VLAN, at the access point, then through to the switch, and from the switch to the firewall, segregating all guest traffic from our business network. That's how easy it is to set up our network locations. We have managed to create a wireless guest access at our lab network location without being anywhere near the place. For this and other topics, please visit us at community.netgear.com.